What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and yo, this mystery update has everyone's balls in the inert state. Inert and alert, my nigga. The shit is getting real now and this is all going to be breaking down in only a matter of a few hours, uh, maybe 24 to 48 hours potentially, um, depending on your time zone of course, but either way, you know, like, like I said in the previous video, these updates are usually a mystery in regards to when they come out exactly precisely, most of, well I mean, no, nah, sometimes they do get precise times, but it's just the details encompassing the update. Now of course, I'm going to be the first one to tell you that you shouldn't let yourselves get too hype about it, because obviously this could very well just be an update that addresses some really minor things, small fixes, nothing too big to be concerned about. But of course you're going to have a lot of hype alongside with it. And you know, I think that's something that you just can't avoid. I mean, it's Smash Brothers for crying out loud. Of course people are going to be excited about it, myself included. And you know, there's things that are happening now out there, and they require some attention. Now obviously 4chan is not necessarily the most credible place, although the biggest leaks for some video games have happened there, including Smash 3DS and Wii U. So. A lot of people say, Etika, why do you give these 4chan leaks, per se, all this merit in some of your videos? I don't. Some of, some, some of the updates, some of the leaks, like the Tower of Smash thing, I didn't give two cents to that fucking shit. But there are some of them that do kind of get my attention, and this, unfortunately, is one of them. But I just need to remind you all, the entire roster of Smash 3DS and Wii U was leaked on 4chan months before during the summertime. You, you, you can't... You can't argue with that. That happened. The entire game was fucking leaked. N no one believed it, but it was. So I mean, obviously, 4chan isn't necessarily the most credible place, but every now and then... Let's take a look at the thread itself right now. We have a link to it from Carbon, who sent me this on Twitter. Carbon, much thanks to you, man. This will be linked in the description below. Um, this guy sent this to me first, and um, obviously it's pretty big now, so everyone's sending it to me, but people want me to address this whole thing. I'm going to save my first reaction for you guys. I did not read what this leak entails, so we're going to be looking at it ourselves and seeing exactly what's going on. So let's take a look at the 4chan thread now. Um... Well, it's not archived yet, although archiving it doesn't really mean shit, to be honest with you. It's just a matter of a vote system. But, I mean, still, this thread has a lot of people's attention, and obviously it encompasses the details regarding to Smash Brothers and the update that might be happening tomorrow or in a few more hours after tomorrow. Yeah, I don't know exactly when it's happening. I mean, some people say that it's happening tomorrow, while others say it's happening on the 1st of September. Today is the 30th, and there's obviously 31 days in um, August, so... We don't know 100% sure exactly what's happening here, or maybe it's just a matter of time zones. Either way, let's take a look at exactly what this brand new leak is telling us that's going to happen in Smash Brothers for tomorrow. Obviously, this is probably going to be really far-fetched, so take this with a fucking grain of salt. Oh, and I should let you guys know as well, too. There's leaks here, potentially. This could potentially be real, so spoiler alerts. I, sh I probably should have said this earlier in the video, but it will be in the title and the description of this video. So, I mean, from this point forward, you could potentially be seeing leaks, although the chances are really low. So let's take a look at exactly what this is, man. The Super Smash Brothers for the Wii U boss battle leaks. <laughs> oh, shit, nigga. <laughs> I gotta take a drink for this one. That required a drink. Boss battle leaks. What in God's name is about to be read here? Indeed. Um, this is from somebody who... Had, was totally anonymous. They didn't even give themselves um, a name through a... Um, through the... Um, what is that? The trick code system. Either way. Indeed. We'll receive new content for Smash Brothers for Wii U on the 1st of September. Boss Mode. Which is the classic boss rush mode from Brawl versus Boss, really, now. Which lets you take control of the bosses, making them playable for the first time. This just sounds... This sounds exactly like a leak that happened before, or, or a fake leak that happened before. Um, wasn't that something that they were saying that would be the case with Ridley? Like, oh yeah, you'll be able to play as him too, you know, you'll control him as a boss character. Like, I, I, I already, this lost most credibility. Master, well then again, you know, Sakurai can throw a curveball. We all know that's what he loves doing. Um, Master Hand, Crazy Hand, Metal Face, Yellow Devil, Master Core, Forms, and Ridley are all playable. Oh my god, are you, oh, here we go. Here we fucking go. Of course. Of course Ridley's playable. <laughs> he has to be playable in every single one of these leaks. It's fucking... It's absolutely necessary, man. Ridley has to be playable in these things. If you don't have a leak on 4... If you have a leak on 4chan and you don't mention Ridley being playable, you ain't doing it right. When beating the mode, you'll get a trophy from a boss character from that game. Samus gets another Ridley trophy. Um, ZSS gets Meta Ridley. Luigi gets King Boo. You get the idea. 
Only Wii U will get this mode for free. 3DS will get a balanced update, though, just like the Wii U. Really? Okay. So, those are some of the details. We have pictures here, which don't mean... They don't mean shit. Master Hand pulls the strings. There's no way in fucking hell this means anything. Um, picture 2 with Master Hand on the same stage as Jigglypuff. Well, we got no Miiverse post for Master Hand? Like, that's not fair. Come on, man. This nigga deserves some love, too. Um... Let me guess, Rayman is controlling him. Um, picture 3, we have uh, boss mode in the middle here. So there are some pictures as well, too, that kind of put this in more detail. Um, looks pretty cool, actually. And when it comes to the pictures themselves, obviously, they put a lot of detail in ensuring that the pictures look like they could be authentic. But at the same time, they're obviously taken off of another screen, which means that, Obviously, they were trying to avoid certain things in quality being noticeable because otherwise they could have just had a screenshot. I don't know. But leaks usually have this kind of a format. It was the same thing with the real leaks that happened in the summer of 2014. So, I mean, although these definitely shouldn't be believed, at the same time, there are plenty of leaks that were legit that happened that were totally real and used this same format. So, I mean, hey, whatever. Um... Right now, I still think it's fake, totally, because I don't think Sakurai would allow us to play as boss monsters in that category, but I mean, who knows? There's pictures, and it seems like there's a lot of them. Um, there's a fourth picture as well, too. This one showcases the boss mode. Okay, doesn't really look like something that would be too hard to throw together in a menu theme. Um, that's the thing, Artsy Omni blew this shit out the water, man. After Artsy Omni's, after, after his deception, of the Smash community, it just became so apparent that these things were too easy to do. Like, I mean, obviously we're going to need more details. Um, if this guy did have access to the boss mode, and, you know, he took pictures like this, what was what was stopping you from um, moving that camera icon to the right and activating your video mode, dog? Video, and trust me, a lot more people would believe. But if it's only pictures, pictures don't really, you know, even even video is questionable, thanks to RT Omni, man. They would have to be some really deep and detailed convincing video. RT Omni really hit it out the park, man. I gotta be real with you guys, but I mean, still, we need video, man. And I'm hoping that there is some. And there's another picture here with Crazy Hand, the orders of fight, okay. And then, um, a sixth picture, which showcases two people inside of the boss mode, with a little icon here on the bottom right that says boss. Hey, boss. <laughs> Give me the real name, boss. <laughs> um, okay. You are taking too long. Show the boss roster. Yeah, man. We, we, we need to see. Why is it just boss on the menu? Yeah, I know. Right? Um, obviously, a lot of people definitely not believing this shit. I'm glad to see that. Um, are there any more pictures? Um, <laughs> this is pretty old, but... um. It shows Ridley all the way on six, like the whole fucking... And Chef Ramsey, what the fuck? Daddy Ramsey, why is he in Smash? What the hell? And, uh, let's see, let's see. Um, okay. Are there any more details here? I mean, I would definitely love to believe it. I mean, it seems like a really cool idea, but... Why in God's name would this thing be so last minute and be included in a quiet update like that? I don't know, man. Um, of course, we have the Arts and Omni leak itself, man. Perfectly done. And it's video. And, you know, oh, man, I remember when I first laid eyes on this, man. I don't think my penis has ever become that hard in my entire life. God damn. Um, let me see. Totally fucking legit. Guy. What, what is this? What is this? I don't even see anything. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, my God. Yeah. My... my my, my, unless we get video, then this thing is going to get crazy. So obviously, guys, grain of salt, please don't take this too seriously. It sounds like a really cool idea, and it would be really out there for something um, in Smash Brothers, but it, 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 I don't think so. No, no, no way in hell. Um, unless we manage to somehow get video from this guy. If you remember back to the summer of 2014, the pictures were posted on 4chan. Everyone doubted the pictures, although they were super new renders that uh, made everyone like, what? New renders? Where did these come from? So, but then, like, a few hours later, or rather a few minutes later, video. Bam! Or rather, was it the next day? I don't remember exactly, but at some point after the pictures were posted, time passed, and then the video happened. If video of this goes up, if video of this goes up within the next few hours, 
I can't explain to you what I'm going to do. I know I can say, you know, my cut my penis off, rusty hook. I don't even know what I'm going to do if this thing actually has a video to accompany it that looks extremely believable. If that happens, man, just fuck me up the ass right away. Please do it. Rusty hook, everything you want. Go ahead. Anyways, guys, these are the details of that 4chan leak. I don't believe it in the slightest. Um, I say right now it has a chance, a um, 95% chance it's going to be fake, only 5% real. I'm only giving it that much of a 5% because he worked really hard on the screenshots, obviously. Um, or maybe not. But, um, hey, and he even hit the text really well, too. This is the precise text from the Smash Brothers trailers, which is $500 if you want to buy it. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I'll talk to you in the next video. Let me know what you think about this leak in the comments below. I'll be responding as usual, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.